Hey guys, this video is for the 21 days plant-based diet challenge. First of all, I want to thank the administrator. I'm not exactly sure who you are, but I can see you. And I also want to thank everyone else who's who took the opportunity to take this challenge. But I know a lot of people aren't aware of exactly what to do, how to do it, because you haven't been eating like this. You haven't been living like this. But a lot of us have... And um, I just want to be able, I, I want to be able to share my own advice as far as how to go about doing this because I'm currently a raw vegan, but I've been on the journey for um, over two years now. So I have a little bit of experience and I think that I can help you guys. So in the morning, the first thing that you're probably going to want to eat is something that's going to not be too heavy on the stomach. I know a lot of times we grow up and whenever we're eating healthy, we're taught to eat grains maybe bread or something like that which is fine because it's plant-based but we need to be reminded that all the processed foods and everything that comes from the stores are full of chemicals and the bread the wheat bread is a it's a high in starch which means it's a it's a hybrid so it's not a it's not a a, a fully natural plant so you want to go towards some, the fully natural foods, which are fruits, vegetables, nuts, and seeds. That's pretty much it. And your fruit categories are your, your um, let's see, your melons, watermelons, cantaloupe. Um, you can eat them all day. In fact, in the morning, your high water flesh fruits are the best fruits to eat. So I posted a video, I posted pictures of mangoes and I got watermelon and I got some peaches in there too because that's pretty much what I'm going to be eating for the next two days. I also have strawberries in the refrigerator, but um, yeah, in the morning it's what, maybe around 9 o'clock or whatever, 10 o'clock, but I'm going to be eating maybe three or four mangoes, you know, every now and then. So today I'll have about eight mangoes, maybe um, a sliced watermelon maybe a peach later on my wife she'll come home and you know do something with the you know, do something with the herbs make a salad or whatever see i'm outside so we have a little garden we have a little garden out here and um you know she can take some chard down there and we got some basil we have um a lot of different types of plants some different type of lettuces down there but um you know you can incorporate all different types of fruits all different types of vegetables if you're feeling nuts it's okay get the nuts the um, the nuts that you want to eat are the nuts that grow on trees such as your almond nuts and your pecans and your walnuts and you hear a lot about the peanuts and a lot about the cashews that's because they're hybrids they grow in the ground they're not getting that sunlight and the sunlight is our primary source of energy all sunlight is converted into that which we call food that's what we're eating we're eating sunlight it's just converted into food so all that sunlight is converted into plant food and that is the food or the herbivore so if you get on this 21 day plant-based diet and you are disciplined and you take you take the time to educate yourself whenever you need to educate yourself so that you won't fall back and that you fall or stumble forward in the right direction don't fall back in the wrong direction but you want to fall forward so a lot of times it's like how do i do this i don't know what to do don't fall back to the old habit because the old habit is too easy and if it's too easy something wrong you need to put your you need to make it to where what you're doing on a consistent basis is at a high level of vibration so that in that 21 day period that high that high vibration really becomes a low vibration for you because you're consistently doing it and you've become accustomed to it and you've become so good at it that it becomes easy so you want a 21 plant day diet to become a daily practice a life practice because this is truly the best way to eat which is your diet a herbivore diet so 